in Baltimore today, the waves weren't high enough. But for the kid from Oakland, the skies were all clear. Rookies aren't supposed to lead the conference in passing, but here's Central Catholic and Pitt product Dan Marino, not only starting for the Dolphins, but in this game leading them to a tie for the AFC Eastern lead. Marino hits Mark Duper in the second quarter for 64 yards, and that sets up Andre Franklin's TD that gives Miami a 14-0 lead. Dan has uh, got the quick release, got a strong, powerful arm, and uh, he's been able to make good decisions and, and get rid of the ball. He's, uh, he's helped us put points on the board. We were struggling offensively, trying to come up with big plays, and Marino has been a big play guy for us. The weather in Baltimore resulted in more than 13,000 no-shows. Dan Marino Sr. showed up, and Dan Jr. showed the old man that the weather was not a factor. Marino to Duper for 28 yards to make it 21-0 in the second quarter. Enough for two wins in a row. We were struggling offensively. We just couldn't get anything going offensively, and uh, we made the change to Marino uh, three ball games ago. We lost that ball game in overtime to Buffalo, but uh, Marino did a great job in that game. And then last week was a winning effort, and today, and I was pleased and proud of our team the way that they played up here in these weather conditions. There's a song that goes into each life some rain must fall. Dan Marino, in his young life, has had his share of rainfall, but so far in the National Football League, his outlook is nothing but sunny. With Dan Marino and the Dolphins in Baltimore, this is Bill Hillgrove for Channel 4 Action News.